Mick Carter, Danny Dyer, seeks comfort from Janine Butcher, Charlie Brooks, in EastEnders, following Gray Atkins, Toby Alexander-Smith, capture. The landlord of the Queen Vic is understandably still struggling to process the fact that Tina, Louisa Bradshaw White, is dead. Gray, as viewers know, murdered the popular character over a year ago, and subsequently hid her body in the Archibaji, where it remained for some time. Phil Mitchell, Steve McFadden, however, stumbled upon it during a showdown with Tommy Moons, Sonny Kendall, Bullies, which proved to be the catalyst in Gray's downfall. After getting wind of Tina's murder, Whitney Dean, Shona Magati, told Mick that she believed Gray had killed her. Shirley, Linda Henry, vowed revenge. Gray, meanwhile, attempted to get out of the square, but as the net started to close in, he realized that he was trapped. The killer admitted to murdering wife Chantal, Jessica Plummer, and Kush Kazemi, David Gadami, and he nearly killed Shirley before he was taken away in handcuffs. The aftermath of his actions have sent shockwaves through Wolford, as the residents come to terms with the fact that there was a murderer in their midst all this time. Mick, meanwhile, recounts previous events in Wednesday's, March 16, offering of the BBC One soap, as he tortures himself thinking of all the ways he could have saved Tina. With Shirley seemingly nowhere in sight, the patriarch of the Carter clan is struggling to open up, and thus he turns to Janine who he feels truly understands him. Pictures of the scenes in question see Janine offering Mick comfort, as she holds him in her arms. The question is, will she make her move on him? Scenes later this week will see the bar manager take Mick out of Wilford for some contemplation. But just what is she up to?